Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a video in collaboration with falseeyelashes.co.uk. This video is going to be kind of like a review slash first impressions of false eyelashes in general because I have only worn false eyelashes twice before. The first time was some really cheap Primark eyelashes a couple of years ago and I looked awful and the second time was when I tried out these eyelashes a week ago and I was actually pleasantly surprised at how well I managed to apply them considering that was technically my first time applying them properly and I think this is quite a good thing that I you know that I am a beginner to this because especially for this video not everybody is you know masters of makeup and pros at everything and not everybody can apply false eyelashes just like that some people can so congratulations well done but I can't so if you're like me and you struggle to apply false eyelashes keep watching this video and let's see how I do it and how I manage to pull it off if I can pull it off because maybe it will give you some hope as well so they sent me this little note that came with the package and it said hi Georgie hope you like the two styles we've picked for you enjoy Jenny so a really cute little note it just adds to the whole thing because I don't actually accept everything that people want to send me. I Some things that people want to send me, I've either reviewed it before and I, you know, I wasn't that bothered about it or I'm just not that bothered about doing a review for it. Like somebody wanted to send me a shower head, you know, it's just random things like that. Whereas this fits in with my channel and I just really like it because if I don't want to do a video on it, then I don't want to accept the product because that's not fair. So I will link down their website and their Instagram down below. Their Instagram is at we love lashes and their website is falseyelashes.co.uk. So go and check out the links and everything like that. I'll link down the eyelashes that they sent me as well so that you can go and have a look and maybe buy them because they are quite nice, I'm not going to lie. Great for a night out. So they sent me two of these, which I'm very happy about. These are the Land of Lashes Faux Minx Lashes. And I've got one, one of them is in the style Aura and the, uh, is that how you pronounce it? Aura, Aurora, Aurora? I, am I just dumb? I think I am. And then the other one is in the style Captivate and I think the ones I tried were the Aurora ones or Aurora or whatever it is and I really liked those. So I think today I'm going to try the ones Captivate and then I will also show you what Aurora or whatever the name is. I will show you that on the screen now because I did actually try them on for Instagram. So I'll show you before and an after of what it looks like with and without lashes so these are the aurora ones so before and after what it looks like i i'm very happy at how i managed to apply them considering it was my first time and one of the eyes went really well and the other one didn't go so great and i think you can probably tell which one's which so there we go so I posted those on Instagram. If you want to go and check out my Instagram or check out their Instagram or posts or whatever, I will link my Instagram down below as well. So in this video, I'm just going to be trying these on, showing you what they look like, how I apply them. Who knows if this gonna, is going to go well. We're just going to see what happens because it's nothing to do with the eyelashes. They do look so good on everybody, only if you apply them correctly because if you can't apply them correctly, like me, then it might end up bad. But we can see, we can try. So if I can do it, then you can do it, trust me. Here we go. So in this little box, they obviously they sent me these two eyelashes from Land of Lashes. They sent me a glue, which is um, Revlon, Revlon Precision Clear Lash Adhesive. So that is really good. Glad I got sent that because last time there wasn't glue, it was just kind of tacky anyway, and it just doesn't work. Glue is good. And then they also sent me this false eyelash applicator tool, which is from falseeyelashes.co.uk. So that is their one. And this honestly, I thought, oh yeah, just a gimmick, you know, just use your fingers. It actually works so well, so much better, so much more precision. So if you don't have this, I would recommend buying this because it is really good. I'm not going to lie to you. So without further ado, let's crack on into the video. Okay, I'm going to put my headband on to get my hair out my face because I'm not going to lie to you. I don't want to get hair in my eyeballs. Oh yeah, by the way, I curled my hair this morning. I don't know if you can tell. Well, you can. Don't know why I said that. Um, but yeah, for the first time ever. Well, not for the first time ever, but you know, 
don't usually curl my hair. So there we go. So now my hair is out of the way. We can zoom you in a bit closer. I've got a cold by the way, so don't look too close. Wow. So at the minute, I've just got a little bit of mascara on and the mascara I'm using is just one from Primark, like just a really cheap one. So the lashes I'm gonna use today are the ones in the style Captivate from Land of Lashes. Like I said, I've tried the Aurora ones and you can go look on my Instagram and have a look at those if you want a closer look. So, I'm actually so nervous because I'm just terrible at applic applying things like this, like eyeliner and false lashes and things like that. I just, it just terrifies me. So, let's get opening the box, shall we? So this is what the eyelashes look like like this. This kind of eyelashes scares the hell out of me because they just look so big, but then I know that they're actually not that big because so many people have so much bigger lashes. I think these are quite nice. So, let's have a quick go at deciding what to do and panicking very quickly. Right, so, okay, I'm not gonna cut these down, or should I? I don't know, I didn't cut the other ones. In fact, I, did I cut the other ones? Don't ask me, I don't know. I'm just gonna have a quick look. So what I'm gonna do is, kind of see where it fits in. Okay, I'm just gonna look on my Instagram and see what I did last time because I just can't remember, you know? Okay, I get it, right. Okay, so let's just go in and see what happens. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get my eyelash and I am going to apply some of the glue onto it. And then you have to leave it for like 20 seconds or 30 seconds. Sorry, the glue just went everywhere. Um, you've gotta leave it for like 20 or 30 seconds just so that it can focus. Um, just so that it's tacky. Because if it's not tacky and it's really gluey, then when you go and stick it on your eye, it's just going to run around. It's not going to, you know, have any tack to it. So, at least I know that. Right, Georgie, where's that? Come. Come. No. Why aren't you staying? Okay, now I've applied one of them and I know it looks so scary when one's on and the other one isn't, but I think when both of them are on it'll look okay. They are bigger than the ones I tried last time. Also, I haven't applied them very well at all, but then I get impatient, so. The bit that I haven't applied well is the bit at the front. It's not really stuck down properly, but I'm gonna do the other one and then we're gonna see how it looks. My eyes are watering. If you can do this and you can do this well, I'm proud of you. I think eyelashes are something that I would wear in videos, but not necessarily in real life, like purely because I just can't be bothered to put them on every day. But I think this is fairly quick. I think if I could, you know, keep doing this, I would be able to master it, but I'm just not really an everyday eyelash kind of person. But if you're going on a night out, then this is great. So again, I'm gonna apply that glue onto it, making sure it's tacky. This is so scary. My brother's back soon and he's gonna be like, what are you got in your face? He says that to everything I put on my face, every makeup product, even if I just had mascara on and nothing else. Right, so we're gonna apply this now. Let's all get scared again. Ah, don't fall off my face or I will kill you. No. What did I say? Do you know what? I have not done these eyelashes justice at all. It's A, my application, B, my application and see my application. Jesus Christ. I, they don't look, ah. mm, Let me know in the comments how you think these look. I think close up, my application is terrible. From afar, so say you was on a night out in a club, from afar, let's zoom us out. Maybe that's, maybe that's what we need right now. Like from afar, you perhaps, 
would just think, oh, somebody's wearing loads of makeup because they're on a night out. What do you think? I think maybe if I went a little bit more simpler on my eyeshadow, then they wouldn't look so bold. I do quite like it, I'm not gonna lie. I do prefer the other style. So these are in the style... K-k-k-k-k-k-k-kitchens. Captivate. And the other one was in the style Aurora or, 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 or whatever it was. I do prefer the other ones, but I do also still like these ones. Personally, I think where this has gone wrong is my application, but they are quite large and maybe I think because I'm a beginner going for something that's a little bit less large maybe would be a good way to start or maybe I should go for, or maybe I should have cut them, you know, that would have been a good idea and fit and actually properly fitted them to shape. But in terms of application, the glue works really well. This glue is really good, so you can go and buy this if you want. I think it comes separately, it should do anyway. And also, this is a lifesaver. The use of this with your hands is just, well obviously you're not going to use your feet to apply it, it's just amazing. So that yeah, it gets a really good grip and you can actually see what you're doing, whether it's with your hands, you're like blocking what you're doing, whereas with this you can see what you're doing. So I do really like these, um, they work so well, so I'm impressed with those. I do like the eyelashes, I prefer the ones I tried for my Instagram rather than these ones, but I still do like them. I think if I applied them properly or somebody actually applied them properly on me, they would look a lot better. But anyway, like I said, this is kind of a beginner trying out eyelashes. What do you expect to happen? With practice, I'm sure I will be absolutely fine. So I will practice a few more times and you'll see in future videos. Thank you to foxeyelashes.co.uk for sending me these eyelashes and collaborating with me on this video I'm so excited to actually have these products to try and to practice with and then maybe I can actually properly did anybody hear that I am so sorry I haven't even eaten yet so I don't know why that happened um, <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> sorry just dying um, but yeah thanks to them for sending me these eyelashes and Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Comment down below if you know how to apply these properly. Please do let me know. Or, you know, if you've tried them. And remember to go and click the links in the description. So for their website, their Instagram, etc, etc. The eyelashes I'm trying. I'll try and link down the glue and everything if I can find it. So just check the description box for everything. But anyway, remember to subscribe for more videos. And I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.